Good morning from day 72. It is a group of bedraggled campers uh, this morning because, oh boy, did it rain last night. We had all of the rain, I think, in uh, a few hours. It was, uh, this, there was a thunderstorm like dancing directly above our head uh, and it pissed it down. Uh, my tent leaked uh, first time that's happened. So I think I either need to reseam seal or potentially just switch out my tent. Uh, if if it's not um, hold, keeping the water out like it used to, then I probably don't need to be carrying the heavier tent, switch it out for a new, a new uh, lighter one. Uh, so I might take a look at that when we get to Waynesboro. Uh, Sass's tent wetted out too. Um, she was swimming, apparently. Gadget's tent was dry, right? I'm sorry? Your tent was dry? No. Oh no, oh no. It's wet and dirty. <laughs> it's wet and dirty. <laughs> Please, my viewers require a bit more c composure than that. Sorry. <laughs> very wet and dirty. Oh no, very wet and dirty. Um, yeah, it, I mean, again, stuff will only hold out so long against rain and it hammered it down. Uh, so, there is a couple of options today. Um, the Appalachian Trail uh, would probably go for about 19 miles uh, to a place called Reed's Gap and then we might get out and take a hitch to uh, Devil's Backbone Brewery which is supposed to be a really cool little brewery about five miles off trail but you can hitch there or there is also a allegedly more beautiful um blue blaze trail the muaha muaha trail maha ma maha ma -la -la trail um <laughs> uh that goes by a lot of um, cascading waterfalls and rock pools and would be ideal swimming uh, ideal swimming hole for the last couple of days where we've had scorching hot weather mm, yeah we're going swimming yeah. in sass's tent oh, yeah. <laughs> um so it's supposed to be beautiful and from people who have done it aka sass and others the comments uh, apparently it's a it's a uh, beautiful uh section and possibly more beautiful than the AT for that section. Uh, it is a few miles shorter, like three miles shorter, um, but it has a, a steep rocky scramble that could be slick in this, um, in this weather, weather, weather. Uh, but it is also the bad weather bypass for the Appalachian Trail. So if there's a lot of um, rain, then apparently the, the water crossing on the AT can be tricky. So, uh, so yeah, so chances are uh, some of us will be taking that blue blaze, like me. Uh, and then others, I think, are probably going to try and take the AT, like Sassafras. Because Sassafras is better than all of us. Definitely better than us. Okay, well, I'm resisting the urge to put the poncho on. New poncho yellow poncho uh, just because it'll get hot and sweaty in there and it doesn't, uh, the rain it was supposed to rain all day today but uh, it looks like the weather forecast has shifted and maybe it dumped it all on us last night and it's going to kind of drizzle on and off for for the morning and then maybe a bit more heavy in the in the evening uh, but we'll see uh, I also Woke up this morning with a what we think is a spider bite. So I am desperately waiting for my spider powers to kick in. Um, so as someone can say, yeah, that great power comes with great responsibility or something. But also, you know, flip, 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 flip through the trees. Hopefully. Anyway, happy hiking. Just look at the amazing views that we have to offer today. Wow. Yeah. I just, I have never seen that shade of gray before. It, it's such a gray. Breathtaking. Bre breathtaking. We 10 out eat, of... We should eat lunch here. 10 out of 10. <laughs> would gray again. Would gray again. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it.
Look at these little dudes. One there, one there. They're so cute. We're so cute. Hi, bud. Buy a salamander, I think. So yeah. cute. I like the way they just like. Someone's decorated this tree with graffiti and some sort of shiny red bird. Looks like a cardinal. And then there's a cool bridge. That looks like it's gonna be bouncy. Yeah, it's a bouncy bridge. Ooh, yeah. Gadget is demanding. That's the view. That's the view. Um. <laughs> Up the river. That's beautiful. And then down river. Also beautiful. I very nearly dropped my trekking poles. That would have been bad. I'm sorry, what? I said also beautiful. <laughs> Good God. So full of herself. Com yeah, confident, not full of herself. Yeah, this is a cool bridge. I like this bridge. Okay, it's raining. It is raining. You are correct. Uh, so we have adjusted our plan uh, and we are not going to the Devil's Background Brewery anymore. Surprise, surprise. We are going to pull up short Surprise, surprise. We're going to pull up short at uh, a shelter because everything's wet. We're wet and it's going to be wet, wet, wet tonight. Uh, so we're going to pull up short there and then push into, uh, or try and push into uh, Waynesboro tomorrow. And also I get the chance to try out my, my new yellow poncho. I prefer the blue. Everyone's a critic. Everyone's a critic. Yeah. <laughs> it was two pounds cheaper. Mm. Eh. Yellow's a good colour. Bye, Gadget! Yeah. Okay. Uh, forest is kind of cool with all this mist and cloud cover all over the place. Uh, although, obviously then, charging through it like some demented giant rubber duck. Quack, <laughs> quack. <laughs> Uh, so that's a, a fun, a fun look. I'm also sweating profusely in this thing because it's very warm. So I'm probably going to de, ooh, very close. I'm going to de poncho for now. <sighs> but yeah, we're going to take the Mao Ha Trail. Again, the, a lot of people say it's, oh. A lot of people say it's it's very beautiful. It's preferable to the AT um, in terms of views. The AT goes that way uh, over there, and is a lot of ridge lines, which in the normal circumstances might be cool, but today is so like full of Swiss octin with mist and fog, so we're not we wouldn't see anything anyway. Um, so we're going to go along here, which has got waterfalls and cascades and rock pools and stuff. So yeah. But yeah, anyway, enough talking, more hiking. Hi. Hey, buddy. He was moving. He was moving along. Is he now just like, no, I'm undercover. They can't see me. You're bright orange, dude. His little legs were moving. <laughs> bright orange. So fast. Go, 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 go. Go on, go on, move. He didn't want to move. Nah. Okay, the uh, climb up the Muha hill was tough. That was a steep, steep climb. Uh, pe people say it's harder than the AT section, um, which compensates, I guess, for the fewer miles you're doing on it, but I couldn't comment. But uh, 
Look at this that we're rewarded with. So much grey. Ooh. I'm sure there's, there's supposed to be some lovely cascading rock pools and waterfalls and stuff. And uh, I'm guessing they'll be down at the bottom of this hill when we get there. And then we'll go back up another hill because, you know, that's what the AT generally is. Downs and then ups. Or ups and then downs. Sometimes downs, ups and downs and then ups. I love to bitch. Yeah, this is pretty amazing. A little swimming hole there. Beautiful. Beautiful. This would have been amazing in that hot day, yesterday and day before. So many little pools for dipping in. Yeah, yeah. Shame we're doing it in the rain, but yeah, would have been amazing. What a great, great trail this is. 